morning guys welcome back in today's video I will share a simple example to mock static methods in Java using jmockit as you know if you follow test driven development you may not have anything static in your code base but if at all there are static methods exist in your code base and you wanted to mock out those static methods jmockit actually give you capability to do that so let's take an example simple example we'll write a simple example today um so we are going to test you know so I used to have a I used to have a manager who shout and yell and scream at people. So we will uh, we will test him today. Test shouting manager, right? He used to be a very good guy when things goes good, but um, when things go bad, when things something goes wrong in the production, he used to get really angry, and he used to start shouting at people, right? Now. We are going to test this guy, shouting manager today. All right, now create a class shouting manager in the main, and uh, we are going to test this guy. Now what are we going to test? Let's initialize this guy using tested annotation uh, from jmockit. What are we going to test? Public void should shout. Shouting manager only can shout, nothing else, right? He will only shout test. So we are going to, sh you know, test his shouting capability. Shout. Now this method doesn't exist, so we will have to create this method. Create method shout, right? Now this uh, this should suppose this is supposed to return why he shout, right? Now we have a. You know, whenever he shout, he need a couple of words to shout. You know, most of them are abusive words. So let's create uh, a, another class. Let's say, dirty word service. Dirty word, word service. This has got a public string get dirty word. Hmm. So what is going to return is it's going to return a random dirty word, you know, every time when he asks. So now we are not writing the random in this case, we are going to write one simple dirty word that he is going to shout at his, uh, his team members. So this is a static, static method and we are going to mock this guy, this static method. So when the shouting manager shout, right? He, he will call the get dirty word service and return it right now this is a method that we are going to test but we are going to mock uh, the underlying dirty service which has got a static method so this static method is the one we are going to going to mock let's see how we can mock that now if you string you know word Now we are going to say okay assert equals is going to say you are such a nice person right but all right let's run this guy so we are expecting you are such a nice person but it's going to fail because you are expecting such a nice person but uh, the shouting manager can only use abc words so what we are going to do is we are smart developers we are going to mock uh, the dirty word service and uh, put some good words into his mouth so dirty word service has a static method get dirty word all right now how do we mock a static method is in jmockit? Jmockit has got a very simple class called mock up 
and that can actually take a type uh, mock up this particular type and what do you want to mock from that particular type you want to mock this particular method right you want to say okay whenever shouting manager calls uh, get data weight service right return uh, something decent right mock so this is the syntax that you will have annotated uh, annotated with uh, mock method and then say this thing so what basically what this basically it is is this mocks native service not the entire class but only this particular method so when shouting manager call the native service get native from the native service which is a static method we will instead of invoking the real implementation we will have this method this mocked implementation invoked now let's run the test case and see if it's work it works mm -hmm. so this is how you mock a static method using j mock it now this is very useful when you when you you know there are a lot of code bases large code bases you have a lot of static methods around and most of them are utility in nature so you don't have to test uh, your task imagine that you have to pass in a lot of state to your static method and that change manipulate the state and then return back and you are not interested in testing those static methods. You are only interested to test, in this case, say, shouting manager. And he has, he has got some more logic in it. Imagine that he has some more logic after after he got uh, the data weight from uh, data weight service. In that case, this will be pretty useful. You can mock your static method um, using jmock it. Thank you very much for watching this video. And have a good day.